Hey guys, my name is Anisia. I'm going to be showing you guys jumps today. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how to prep into a jump and what the basic jumps look like. So let's start off with what the jumps look like. I want you to sit on the floor how I'm doing. And this is going to be a toe touch. You want to sit with your legs as strong and apart as you can and your arms are going to be in a T. When you're in the air, this is what a toe touch will look like. And then we're gonna bend our left leg back and keep our right leg straight. This is what we call a herky. And then your arm or your leg that's straight, your arm will be out in the T still. Your leg that's bent, that arm will be in a fist on your hip. And then it'll be the same for the other side. For a pike, you're gonna wanna sit sideways. And then you're gonna wanna keep your legs together, squeezed and tight. And your arms are gonna go in candlesticks, perfectly at parallel. And then a hurdler, you're gonna wanna sit on one knee and keep your other leg straight. This is my right side, so we're doing right leg forward. And again, arms in candlesticks. And then if you're gonna do left side, same thing, just on the other side. This is what you should look like in the air. So the lines are interesting, you go, um, 45 degrees, not totally horizontal or totally 90 degrees. Um, but you're gonna want to sit like this. It looks like a nine with your legs, but then you're gonna make a nine with your arms. Come on. So your arms are gonna look like this, and your legs are gonna look pretty much the same. And then come on to the other side, you just switch legs, switch arms. Okay, guys, now I'm gonna show you basic jumps and how to prep it to them. We're gonna start off with the toe touch. I'm gonna to show you what it looks like, and then I'm gonna show you how to prep into it. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Okay, so now to prep into it. You're gonna start off at clean for five, six, seven, eight. On one, you're gonna bend your knees and clasp. I'll show you what it looks like from the side. Bend your knees and clasp. Your arms are gonna be at a 90 degree angle in your clasp. So for two, for a toe touch, you're going to go up. After one, you're going to go up on your toes in a high V. And your legs are going to be straight. So five, six, five, six, seven, eight. One, up, two. After one, up, two, we're going to cross our arms down on three. So five, six, seven, eight. One, two, around three. And then your jump will be hit on four. I'll show you from the side. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, around three. And then you hit on four. For now, let's just hit a T, a T jump. So T jump looks like this. We're gonna prep into it doing a T jump. Five, six, seven, eight. One, up, two, around three. T jump four. So you're always gonna want to land. Toe heel. And with your arms clean and your legs bent. To the door, your jump. So let's do that one more time. Five, six, seven, eight. One, up, two, around, three, jump, four. Now let's try that with the toe touch. Do the best you can. Doesn't have to be perfect right away. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And every time you land a jump, you absolutely want to land with your feet together as, as close as possible. Okay, so now let's go into a herky. Herkies have the same prep as a toe touch. And if you'll remember when we sat on the ground and I showed you the positions, that's how you're gonna want your legs to look. So arms like this, leg up straight, leg back bent. So let's try and prep into that. Let's start with a right herky first, and then I'll show you from the back so you can get a better view. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And then I'll show you from the back so you can see how I position my arms and legs. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Once you get that down, we can try left side. Some people have stronger left side, some people have weaker left sides. Personally, I have a weaker left side, so my left leg doesn't go as high as my right leg. So let's try a left turkey. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And I'll show you the back again. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. 
Now I'm gonna prep into a hurdler. Hurdler preps are a little bit different. On two, instead of going from your clasp to your high V, we're gonna go clasp to come. So it'll look like this. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Hurdlers are a little bit different because you have to turn to the side. Otherwise, it's just gonna be light in the base. And you can't really see what the jump looks like. So when you turn to the side, it's gonna look like this. Five, six, seven, eight. So right now I'm going to do a right hurdler, and then I will teach you a little bit more in depth. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. So if you remember what we did on the ground, um, when we turn and we go this way, we go down and we hit our jump, our arms are at candle six this time, and you want your leg to go through your arms. If it doesn't go all the way through your arms, don't worry about it. You'll stretch and get better at it. I promise you. So we had our jump. Arms are at candle six. Leg through. Back leg goes up and as bent as possible. Okay, so let's try that jump one more time. This is a right hurdler. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, hit, four. And then when you land, you're going to land facing this way and you're going to stand up facing the front. So before we just start jump, one, two, three, hit, four, down, five, six, stand up and turn, seven, eight. That's how you're gonna land any jump that you're facing not forward to. Okay, so now for a left hurdler, left hurdles are the same, but you're gonna turn to the left. And your arms are gonna be the same, you're just gonna do your left leg up, right leg back. So let's try a left hurdler. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, hit, four. Okay, so let's move on to pikes. Pikes have the same prep as a hurdler, where you clap and turn to the side and up in a cone. Same prep. Pikes, you always turn to the right side, unless we're doing something different. So, a pike jump, if you, if you remember on the ground, we're sitting down, hands and candlesticks, and then both legs are gonna come up as high as they can at the same time. I'll show you what it looks like really quick. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. Okay, so let's move on to double nines. Double nines, again, are a little tricky. Um, I showed you on the ground, arms like this, legs also like this. <laughs> so for a double nine, the preps are the same as a hurdler and the pike with the cone. But instead of turning all the way to the side, you're gonna turn to the 45 degree. I'm gonna show you what it looks like and then I'll show you a little bit more in depth. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. And then left side is the same, facing the left side. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Okay, so I am gonna teach you this on my right side because that's my better side, but you can feel free to do it on your left side. So when doing a double nine, you wanna turn, clap, turn up to the corner, and when you hit, you're, if you're facing the right side, your right leg is gonna be up and your right arm is gonna be straight. Then your left leg will be bent and your left arm will be bent. And then if you're facing the left side, Left leg straight, left arm straight, right arm bent, right leg bent. So let's try and prep into that really quick. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, jump four. Okay, so let's try it all together now with the jump. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, jump four. Okay, that was all the basic jumps. Um, then we also do side to side and around the world. I'll show you what those look like and then I'll show you a little bit more in depth. So I'm gonna show you side to side first. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. So when doing a side to side, you're gonna keep your, you're gonna do a right leg hurdler the whole time. So when you prep, instead of prepping right, you're gonna prep left. So five, six, seven, eight, one, up, two. You're still gonna do a right hurdler, even though we're facing left. One up, two, down three, hit four. And then you're gonna turn and clap to the back for the next prep. Five, turn back to this way where you're facing, up six, around seven, hit eight. Clean, turn. Okay, so let's do it one time. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, Three, hit four, five, six, seven, hit eight. Okay, good. So now we're gonna do a 
around the world. Around the world, it looks like this. I'm going to show you. You can do this with either a hurdler or a pike. I'm going to show a hurdler for now. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, five, four. So in an around the world, you're going to prep facing the front. Five, six, seven, eight. Clap one, two. You're going to turn. As you turn, your arms are going to go into that cone until you get all the way around. So try that a little faster. It takes a minute to get used to. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two. Once you get that turn down, try it with the hurdler jump, and I'll do it with you. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, hit, four. And if you've got that down, you can try with the pike, and it'll look like this. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, hit, four. Now you've learned all the jumps.